should I invest in GTCO or should I run away? Watch this video to the end if you're looking to invest in GTCO or you're looking to invest in real estate. Let's go. So let's go. I'll be reading it out for you, okay? GTCO offers subscribers ordinary shares of 50 Kobo at 44.50 Naira per share. This offer started on Monday 12th july 2024 and closes on 12 august monday 2024 this offer means that equity financing where gtco offers a fixed shares to their subscribers right know that this is not a financial advice it's not a financial advice it's for educational purposes right this is all done to raise capital and not for the common man right let me give you reason why gtco is doing this Number one, recapitalization of GT Bank in Nigeria. Number two, growth and expansion of the group. Acquisition of pension funds, administration, assets, management, and businesses. This is also because CBN requires the bank to increase their minimum paid in common equity capital to a specified amount according to their license categories and also within this specific period of time. My opinion is, listen, it is not worth the investment unless you want to invest for very long term, like for 10 to 20 years. If you're looking to grow your money, it's better you invest in real estate. In real estate investment, you can see your investment and also you can feel it unlike buying shares in the bank. You know, you don't see it and you don't feel it. Last year, GTCO paid 94.180 billion in rewards which is 30.20 naira per shares imagine you bought shares of 5 million naira last year which is 112,359 shares and gtco paid 3.20 naira per shares you will be getting 359,550 naira for your shares so imagine you invested that same money in legacy estates transequent Enugu for 5 million naira uh, at about the same time, let's say around January, February, March last year. You'll be selling that same land for 22 million naira right now. So do the maths. It's about 400% return on investment, which is you made your money times four or more, right? Remember, this is not a financial advice, it's just for educational purposes. Here are some proof to show you that Legacy Estates was sold for this amount last year and now people are selling it for 22 million naira minimum. People are selling it for 22 million naira and above. So here I come to the end of this video. Let me know what you think about this video in the comment section below and let me know if you will invest in real estate or you rather buy shares from the bank have a lovely day bye bye